Hey, I'd like to welcome you to another episode of the Mission Matters Luxury Podcast, your source for all things luxury and lifestyle. My name is Adam Torres. You can follow me on Instagram at Ask Adam Torres. Keep up with my book releases, book tour schedule, signings, all that other good stuff. Always love to connect with you there. And as always, if you'd like to apply to become a co-author of one of my upcoming books, just head on over to the website, missionmatters.com, and click on Become an Author to Apply. All right, so today I have Kush Kapila on the line. He's founder and CEO over at Sterling's Mobile Salon and Barber Co. Kush, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me, Adam. So uh, excited to get into today's topic. So you have some, we have some exciting partnership announcements and expansion announcements, and we're going to get into that. But before we do, um, let's get a little bit further into what you're doing over at Sterling's Mobile. Uh, tell us a little bit more about the company, please. Uh, so Sterling's Mobile is a mobile salon and barber shop. Uh, we contract with Fortune 500 companies, bring our services on site once a week, every other week, once every four weeks. And then the busy professional can go online to our custom-built booking system, book a cut, color, shave, read the bios of their favorite barbers and stylists, walk downstairs, and get a convenient cut in one of our converted Airstreams which have three stations, a restroom, waiting area, fully self-contained uh, with water and electricity. Uh, so you get the convenience, the quality, at a price that's comparable to what the chain salons uh, charge out there. Wow. When I saw this, I was like, man, what a great concept and how convenient. I'm like, how come I can't just walk outside and get that done um, from work? So I love the concept. Um, how how'd you come up with this? Because you've been in business for a while now. I mean, how would you come up with this? Uh, so I'm probably uh, the farthest removed person from coming up with this idea. Uh, my background's in high tech and bio, um, but uh, I came up with the idea back in 2010. I was working full time, uh, doing my uh, MBA at UCSD, so studying full time. And uh, it was on the weekend. I went to a chain salon and ended up waiting 40 minutes and asking for my hair to be cut um, short. Uh, and they ended up giving me a buzz cut. So frustrated, uh, driving back <laughs> home, driving back home, and I saw a food truck, and that's where the genesis of Sterling's Mobile came from. I saw that explosion of mobile services kind of permeating every aspect of our life, you know, food trucks and mobile dentistry and pet, pet grooming. But what I hadn't seen is it being done in the hair care market where, you know, something that I had to do every every four weeks and was a frustrating process oh my gosh that's a great story you're like i figured it had something but so you saw the uh you saw this food truck and then the gates just opened for you you were like did you hear the the sound like the uh -huh. <laughs> that's <laughs> exactly. a great story <laughs> um so let's get let's get into uh let's get into some of these announcements you have going on so artist shaving which is owned by procter and gamble i mean you're spanning to the uh to the bay area i mean tell us some more about what you have going on um, so we signed a multi-year partnership with Artist Shaving, which is owned by Gillette, which is owned by Procter & Gamble, last year. And uh, they gave us uh, some funding and a very good relationship to sell their products to expand to different markets. So we're here in San Diego. Uh, as of November, uh, we launched in Orange County, and then we're planning on launching in the Bay Area actually what's going to happen the week of the shutdown <laughs> with this uh with covid um but uh you know as soon as that's over we'll we'll be up in the bay area providing services there man that's exciting and love artist shaving great company also um I'm, and when they were in century city over by me i used to go all the time I and mean, that was my that was my quick spot so love that place and uh, i think it's going to be a great partnership and thing for you um so that being said uh if somebody what um what areas are you in now so if somebody's listening to this and they want to learn more about the service if they're um either if they're and um and by the way um, I should I should make the distinction. Um, is it just for companies to be able to call and book, or can individuals come? Like, how does this work? Give us a little bit more there on how people actually use the services. Yeah, so to answer your first question, if you go to sterlingsmobile.com, you can see a list of our locations. Currently, we're in San Diego and Orange County, uh, and then soon to be the Bay Area, as we uh, as I mentioned. Um, it's open to the public, so we you know companies look for us to bring the service but anyone can come 
from any location and um, come in and get that those services. Fantastic. Um, well, hey, Kush, it's been great having you on the show today. I'm um, wishing you much success, continued success with uh, Sterling's Mobile. Love it. Love the partnerships you're doing and love the expansion efforts. So great stuff there. And uh, to the audience, as always, thank you for tuning in. Hope you got a lot of value out of this. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the podcast. Uh, leave me a review on the Apple iTunes store. Uh, if you're watching this on our YouTube channel, Mission Matters Luxury, uh, definitely give us a subscribe there, but also leave us some comments on the video. I mean, we'd love to know what kind of business businesses and projects you're working on. And Chris, thanks again for coming on the show.